Welcome back, everyone, to another edition of Rudy's Rant, powered by Come On Out, the podcast. I am your host, Rudy Rodriguez Shomont, and I got a rant to jump in on for you today. It is one that really, really fucking pisses me off. It pisses me off. It's bad enough to lose a World Series. It feels crappy enough. There is something to be said for winning with Dignity, winning with humility, winning with class. But that is not something that exists in Los Angeles Dodgers pitcher Joe Kelly. Before I jump in, thank you to to everyone for your continued support of our channel. Be sure to pound the like button, subscribe, share the video. Hit that bell and become a member as we will be dropping membership content. So become a member today. We greatly appreciate you. Joe Kelly, former Boston Red Sox pitcher, Joe Kelly. You know, it's one of those things where you can take it a whole lot easier if the guy actually mattered. But Joe Kelly doesn't matter. Joe Kelly is irrelevant. Joe Kelly wasn't even on the active playoff roster for the Los Angeles Dodgers. He did not pitch in the World Series. There's nothing more aggravating than a guy who doesn't play, who talks shit. Ask any athlete. You can deal with the guy talking trash to you if he's the one putting up the numbers, putting in the buckets, throwing the touchdowns, catching the touchdowns, hitting the homers, striking out the other team. I mean, all every sport you could think of. But when it's the guy who didn't do shit, talking shit, That crap is irritating and it's annoying because you have no need to talk, homie. You didn't play. And his opinion, utterly ridiculous. Listen to what this buffoon had to say. And I'm not going to sit here and say I completely disagree with him. But is this how, this is how people, this is, this is class. You're, you're real classy dude, buddy. Let's, let's jump on in here. You said you play the Yankees base. So did you guys know? Was that sort of the Absolutely. thing? Absolutely. Yeah. We we were saying every single game, just let them throw the ball to the infield. They can't make a play. I mean, you saw Shoei got an extra base going to third on sloppy Glaber play. It's 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 well known. We all knew. I mean, we're the Dodgers. We know every little detail. There's nothing more aggravating and agitating than an egotistical douchebag like Joe Kelly. We're the Dodgers. We knew. We know every little man. Shut the fuck up, you clown. Driving the car while being interviewed, looking into his phone. Real safe, dumbass. How about you park and pull the fuck over? How about you take your sunglasses off while you're talking to somebody in an interview? You fucking loser. We're the Dodgers. We knew. Man, shut the hell up. But, I mean, past that, it was, it was, uh, it was a fun series. I mean, they almost they almost snagged, snagged a couple of wins. You know what I mean? But I mean, they almost snagged a couple of wins. The Yankees were winning three two in the tenth. The Yankees were winning six five in the eighth in Game Five. Almost snagged a couple of wins. Eh, this dude is a clown. The Dodgers were better than the Yankees. I have granted that they were better. They did the little things. That are, that are what is necessary to win games of this nature. This dude's a clown. I mean, if if it was like if it was like the NCAA, like basketball, baseball, hockey, or football, I mean, like it's it was just a mismatch from the get go. Like we had a playoff re ranking. Like they might be ranked eighth or ninth best. That's fucking stupid. They might be ranked eighth or ninth. Is is that for real? The, the what he's saying. So let's talk about that. They might be ranked 8th or ninth. They won the American League, you fucking moron. 
That means they're better than the top. They're, they're the best team in the American League. They had the second or third best record in baseball behind the Dodgers and I think the Phillies. If I'm not mistaken, the Phillies, I believe, finished a game ahead of the Yankees. Had the best record in the American League. They beat the Royals in four, and they beat the Indian Guardi Indians Guardians in five. They cruised into the World Series. They cruised into the World Series. And in fact, they had a lead, a two-to-one lead in the eighth inning against the Dodgers in game one. This guy, I, I mean, eighth or ninth. So that means they're worse than every, that, that means in his opinion, in his illustrious opinion of being a fucking idiot, this guy thinks that the Yankees were worse than the Milwaukee Brewers, the Mets, the Braves, the Padres, the Phillies. Hey, you want, you want to argue the Phillies? Well, the, the Phillies got eliminated in the first damn round in the divisional playoff. The Braves went home in two games, I think it was, in the, in, in the wild card. The Brewers went home in the wild card. the hell we talking about here this is clown stuff dodgers won sure don't dare sit here and tell me that the yankees will be the eighth or ninth best team in the field of 14 the yankees make mistakes we know this this guy's classless he's a classless putz that's playoff team you know what i mean like you're putting the Padres ahead of them. You're putting the Phillies ahead of them. You're putting the Mets ahead of them. You're putting the Braves ahead of them, and the Braves just got unlucky because they had to play that doubleheader. You're putting, I mean, the Guardians played like crap, but the Guardians played better, better deep. Guardians played like crap? Oh, 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 who, who, who pitched? Who pitched? You twat. Who pitched? They couldn't hit because the Yankees could pitch. I don't know if you noticed this, Joe Kelly, but outside of having the extra inning game, Outside of the extra inning game, the Dodgers, through nine innings, scored two runs, four runs, four runs, and four runs until game five. The Yankees scored 11 in game four, six in game five, and while obviously the Yankees lost, the Dodgers were not tearing the cover off the ball against Yankees pitching. They hit 206 for the series. 206. Whereas against the Mets, the Dodgers were clobbering the ball. Against the Padres, the Dodgers clobbered the ball. Against the Yankees, they weren't clobbering shit. Even in game five, it wasn't clobbering crap. They got, they got three extra outs in getting the fifth inning. They weren't clobbering shit. Their eighth inning rally was a single an infield single, a walk, and then two sacrifice flies. They did not hit. This guy's an idiot. Be better baseball around. Like, there's, it was just a complete mismatch, and it's kind of the same feeling from 2018 when we had to go play the Dodgers. Like, the Red Sox were just a way better team. Um, this guy just walks around. He, he's like that guy that you want to punch in the face. He, he has that I want to punch you in the face attitude. The Dodgers, the Red Sox was a much better team. Yeah, that was the year the, the Red Sox won 108 games. Yeah, they were they were they were a really good team, and he was on that team. So now he's being a douchebag in that. But homie, you didn't play this year though. You should be the last person doing interviews when your sorry ass ain't playing. Um, so all we knew is that we just had to play regular Dodger baseball. We didn't have to play out of our butts. We didn't have to do anything crazy, and we we're going to win the World Series. Um, it's facts. Like just, 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 just look at the team, look at the talent. Re rank the teams and they're ranked eighth, and they played against the number one seed. So, um, but like I said, everyone knew we had we had, we go through numerous scouting reports, videos like, hey, look at this is sloppy play. Like, um, I mean, we we pay attention to every single detail. Um, 
you know, we have a lot of big superstars in our clubhouse, but the superstars also care and aren't lazy um, and play hard. So that's the difference in the biggest separator. Look, man, I'm not I'm not going to harp on the component of we have superstars that aren't lazy. I, I, I like I said, I, there are things that I agree with. He could have said this entire thing a lot differently and not sound like a complete fucking asshole, like a douchebag. Because I'm going to tell you right now, if I'm the Yankees and I play the Dodgers and that guy happens to be on the team next year, I want him to hit. I want him to hit because I'm going to plunk him in the face with a ball. Because he's talking out of his ass. He's being mad disrespectful. Like, these are things that you just don't do in professional sports. He could have said all of that stuff and said, look, we looked at scouting reports. We've seen them play. We know they get sloppy on defense. They don't run the bases all that well. These are all This, this is all data, and we all know this. This is not a, a secret. But sitting here saying that they're the eighth or ninth best team in the playoffs, you're a fucking moron because it's factually wrong. And you sound like one of them bitter bitches who play for the Boston Red Sox, and you feel like in your brain you're still a member of the Boston Red Sox. So you carry this feeling over of animosity with you to the Dodgers, and that's fine and dandy and all, but you sound like a clown because there's not a person on earth that thinks the Yankees were the ninth best team in baseball. They were the best team in the American League. They won the American League championship. They won the pennant. You can't be the eighth or ninth best team if you won the pennant in the American League. They finished four games ahead of the Mets. Four games ahead. I'm sorry, five ahead of the Mets. Five ahead of the Braves. One ahead of the Padres. One ahead of the Brewers. They finished with the third best record in Major League Baseball this year behind the 98 wins by the Dodgers and the 95 by the Phillies. So, no, you're factually wrong, you clown. And they went to the World Series where they had some defensive lapses that cost them two wins that would have had a game six being played in L.A. But they escaped. You escaped. You escaped. You had the better defense. You came up with key situations. And your team, not you, because your sorry bitch ass didn't play. Your sorry bitch ass did not play. So you can take your fucking opinion. You can shove it up your motherfucking ass. Because no one's going to see Joe Kelly's name in the box score. They shouldn't even give your bum ass a ring. That is the example of a classless piece of sewer garbage. That's Joe Kelly. Yeah, I'm angry about it because you know what? We all know how the Yankees lost. You acting like you did something special to make it happen as a team? The Dodgers did nothing special to win game five. Nothing. A drop fly ball, an error by Volpe, a mistake, a lazy play by Rizzo. An Aaron Boone decision in the eighth inning. That's why you won game five. You won game one. Why? Yes. Bad defense. Yes. You didn't do that. You didn't force the bad defense. And that's what makes these comments a joke. If you had actually forced these situations, that's different. Stolen base. Stolen base. Base hit, fly, sack fly. You forced that. You made that happen. But you didn't make what happened in game one happen. You didn't make what happened in game five happen. The Yankees gave it to you on a fucking plate. So, yeah, in that regard, you're correct. They'll give it away, and they did. But that doesn't make them the ninth best team in the playoffs, you idiot. Man, let me know your thoughts in the comments. This is Rudy's rant, facts over feelings. Come on now, the podcast. I want to get your comments. I want to get your opinions because, man, when you hear stuff like this, it just bur- it burns me because this, this motherfucker didn't even play one single inning. He wasn't on the roster. And yet he's yakking. Get the fuck out of here. Leave a comment, ring that bell, subscribe, become a member. Appreciate you. Come on now.